Hello, it's robot drawing time, and the robot we will be drawing today is Tombstone. Diving right in, got America's Panther, the normal Panther, got the America's Panther, the normal Panther. Also, important, I got a reference photograph that I will be looking at to draw this picture of Tombstone. Okay, it's death time again. First line. <gasps> First line. It's gonna go like. It's gonna go like. Oh, oh, oh. It's gonna go like. A quath. First line. Woo! First line. Okay, okay. More lines. We're doing more lines. I'm just gonna start quick, rough sketch. Because we're, we're rough in this place. Not really. I'm not rough at all, actually. But we're rough in this place. I'm gonna go like death, go to do the death, I'm gonna do death, and then we're gonna go like death. Then we're gonna go like go like go like death. Yeah. We're gonna have another line that goes like oh 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 boom. Right across. There we go. Okay, gotta get the first rough sketch. That is very important. You know, it's hard to start with just a blank piece of paper, but if you just get that first rough sketch and you go you go at it like you're a fierce you're a fierce jaguar. You gotta, you can't be a kid again. You gotta be a drug lawyer. And you just gotta go on, go after it. You just gotta do it. You just gotta get into it. You gotta just do it. You gotta be like, okay, there's a line right here. And the line right here, I'm gonna go on like this. This is Tombstone's buddy. I got a little X here to mark like where I wanted it, but I think I'm already going off of it. Like a little X in each corner. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna make a death bag. I'll put a little X there. But I'm already going off my, my drag. You're not going to see this bottom line right here, but I'm just going to put it in for fun. So Tombstone's got this big blade. Oh my goodness. He's got the coolest, giantest, giant blade you've ever seen in your life. And it's so powerful and fun to watch because it just rips, rips butt. It rips butt up. But yeah, Tombstone, he's super cool. He's like, he's really cool. He's really fun to watch. Because it's so fun because things, the things are just flying everywhere. And then there was that one time he drove while he was on fire for like two minutes. And you're like, oh my goodness. And he just won't stop. And he was just like, boom, boom, boom. And he's on fire. And it's just, it was awesome. He's really cool. Really fun to watch. Oh my goodness, just tires. These tires, guys. Will Queen Jack get better at drawing tires? Probably. Maybe not today. But probably. Yes, this is my hairy tire. Tires, man. Like I like I've mentioned before, I just gotta chew at them. I just gotta chew at them until a pretty good shape comes down. I just chew and chew and chew. That's basically what happens. Okay, I'm gonna get serious now. I gotta get some details on her. Let me measure. It. Let me look at my reference. Starting my reference, and I'm like, okay, okay. The thing that holds his wheels on. It's like this, this certain thing, and it goes down like this, and it's strangely rounded, and then there's like this metal piece that goes like this, and then it goes up, and it's a very complicated system of bolts and stuff that, that the guy, that Ray Billings, you know, he probably really well thought out how these tires hook on, really Really well thought out, and I'm trying to draw it in like two seconds. That's the that's the beauty of drawing, man. You can get things done in two seconds. Four hours later. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. There we go. There we go. We got it now. We're getting. We're chewing away at this tire. We're chewing away at it like I once saw a dog, Joe Astrick. Chewing, chewing away with violence until we get that perfect shape. And then we go down and we're like, wow. Yeah, Tombstone, he's really fun to watch. He just, I, it's, it's like, I don't know, there's just something about him. He's like, when he's, when he's going in and, and fighting bots, it's like just so awesome, you know? Just has this element of awesomeness. Ooh, that's a, that's a nice chilled up line. But like I said, we're just getting the main basic scratch. 
because you can't go too detailed too fast. That's a big problem with drawing, you know, you want to make it beautiful in the first two seconds. There's those two seconds again. You want to just make it beautiful, but really, you just need to get the basic thing and then you can make it pretty, you know? That's the thing about drawing, you just can't go great great about it. You can't be like all crazy, like, oh, there's a line of the big perfect. You know? So I'm just chewing, chewing away. That's, that's my word of the day, chewing. And you can see me turn it up, I turned the paper because it makes it easier for me to get a good line. You should always turn your paper all around when you are drawing because it helps to make it look more 3D. If you just sit in one place and you just go da da ba 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 ba, then it doesn't, you know, it doesn't work out as well. It doesn't look as 3D, it looks a little bit more flatter. It's really cool to see, you know, this blade. Spoiler alert! This blade is red. And it's really cool. I really like his red blade here. I don't think it's his quite his strongest one, but it's still really cool. I'm gonna get this line back over here to the better. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. We are getting in some price. It's like, uh, it's like taking a bus ride. You know, you're you're just driving around aimless, and then boom, you're at the place. When was the last time you took a bus ride? I have never in my life taken a bus ride. Oh, Jocka, never. I don't know, never did, never did it. You know, now that I'm looking at this line back here, I think it needs to come in on that bus. Because if I go like this. I'm, I'm going out like this, going out with that, that, that line, that part of it, the trathy. Trathy is a really funny word, but I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. And then it goes down like this, and this is the trathy. So maybe, I, maybe I'll have to bring this line in right here, maybe, maybe it's a little too big. Let me see. Let me go back. Boop, boop, boop. Maybe like this. Mmm. It'll better. Gotta get the proportions correct. At the same time, he's sitting in perspective. Meaning some parts of him look better, bigger than others, bigger than their actual size, because he's parts of them are closer to us, right? I think I'm gonna have to fix this wheel just a little bit because looking at my reference and looking at this object on this paper, this looks a little weird to my eyeballs. So I think I'm gonna have to fix it maybe just a little bit. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. This is gonna have to be fixed. <gasps> da, 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 da. Well used, high quality plastic erase. Why did they say plastic? What were erasers made out of before they were plastic? Quick question. <laughs> These are strong pencil shavings. They don't want to blow away. There we go. You know, you know what I always say? You're learning how to draw, you learn on how to erase them. Because you can't learn to draw without knowing how to erase them. Okay, let's see if this looks better. Does it look better? Yes, I believe it does. Better put back draw. Does it look strange? Better way than strange. But no concern. I'm just gonna be redrawing this uh, wheel here. I'm gonna redraw the wheel. And then I'm gonna take all my lines and I'm gonna make them pretty. I'm gonna set them all up. I'm gonna clean it up. I'm gonna clean up this, this chode, these joins, and I'm gonna make a drawing out of these joins. It's, it's magical, okay? Okay. Oh yeah, talk to you in a minute. Okay, guys, as you can see, the basic sketch is 
done. I just went in and straightened up my lines a little bit, made them a little nicer. Boom, 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 boom. And now it's ready for this Prisma Cutter Premiere pen in 05. So I'm gonna jump right into the line art here. I'm gonna fast forward it because everybody gotta go out and get some dinner. We can't be sitting here drawing all day. You know, there's, there's things to do. You gotta weed your petunias. You gotta sweep your porch. So I'm just gonna fast forward the line art and we're gonna see it coming on. Then let's dive right in. Da 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 da. Smack. Okay, I got the line art all done. Woo! Woo! It looks kind of, kind of epic. Line art. Line art really brings things to life. It's really fun to do. As you can probably tell by this cut art pencil, I'm going to start cuttering it now. And the first thing I'm going to cut her is... <gasps> the blade. The awesome, amazing, red blade. First thing. Okay. So the blade is really shiny in certain places, and it's really dark in other places. So I'm gonna, oh, I'm just gonna dive right in. I know I, it's gonna be like a shiny place right here. So I'm gonna make a line, gonna make a line, you know, gonna make a line. Okay, this is gonna be light. This is gonna be dark, and then uh, get kind of shiny right here. Okay, so in this region is shiny. So I'm gonna make a little mark. I'm gonna mark it off for the shiny places. Okay, death is pretty light. Uh, death is pretty dark. Death and then death. So let's, uh, let's dive right in. So I recently watched a YouTube video about colored pencil. And they said that you should, you should color in a certain direction. You should do it lightly in kind of circular motion. And you should go in a certain direction. Like I'm kind of going this way. Like this. You gotta do it slow and steady. And the cutter pencil had to be like really, really well sharpened. So I tried to sharpen mine really good. And then you just kind of go slow. Speed it up so it's fast. Okay. And then you should go the opposite direction. <gasps> Radical. And that should help to fill up all of the spaces. That the, that the, 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 the I, I don't know why the word won't come out of my mouth. All of the spaces that the color pencil missed the first time. So it would look more smooth. And we want this to look really smooth. Because it's really shiny. And it's really smooth. 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 That's weird. It's really smooth. I feel like I'm saying smooth really strangely. But I'm trying, guys. I'm trying. I'm just gonna keep darkening this area because it is a pretty dark red. They say like when you like when you press really hard on your cutter pencil like that. Oh, oh, scary! It's called burnishing, burnishing. I don't really know why. I just heard that. Just gonna be keep darkening it. I'm gonna darken this. I'm gonna try to try to do something different over here, but I'm just gonna keep darkening this. Okay, okay. Okay, I got the base coloring done, I think. And now I'm going to do some fancy stuff. By which I mean, I'm going to go in and there's this really funny part on the, on the blade right here, which is dark. So I'm going to just going to go into red and I'm going to be like, oh. 
I'm not really sure why, but there's like this reflection right here. That's really dark. Well, it's not really, really dark, but it's darker than the west. And that's kind of dark over here. So I'm just kind of, you can see how I'm trying to shade it so it looks really shiny, you know? I want it to look really, really shiny. I think I need to darken this like whole section up a little bit. Let me just go across the opposite way I did before. I'm just gonna just gonna a little bit more, yeah, maybe a little bit darker. And then you know what's really funny? I'm gonna take this black one and I'm gonna shade underneath this part right here. Underneath it, cause that shadow of death is falling on the blade. It's pretty cool. Shade that other one. Okay, but that's basically how I color the blade. Now, I'm going to go in and I'm going to color everything else. So, I'm just going to be doing that. Boom. Okay, guys. It's all done. Here's my picture of Tombstone. I got it all drawn, line ordered, and colored. And look at that chain. Woo! It's a strong chain. The power of strong weapon. Weapon. Whoppa. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this drawing video. Always remember, to learn how to draw, you gotta learn how to erase. Hope you have a great day. Okay, goodbye. Bye, 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 b